why don't you stay? and a mess. So today, <laughs> we're going to be, so you can spell the title, we're gonna be doing another skincare video. This week or two weeks, depending how long this thing lasts, we're going to be testing the Tatcha face cleanser, okay? I have a sample size, it looks like this. This is the deep cleanse, and I've been wanting to try it. First of all, it's expensive. <laughs> And second of all, this is supposed to be like amazing, amazing for your skin. Like everyone is like, man, I love Tatcha. And I've never tried it. We are going to be showing our skin. This is before. So I want to see the improvement. I have a little bit of discoloration right there. And um, I have a little bit right there. And then up here I have a little bit. And we're going to see if this is going to work. The normal cleanser I usually do use is the CeraVe Salicylic Acid one. That's the one I just finished. It did amazing. Wonders for my face. Mwah. But now we're going to try this out. And I want to see if it's worth the hype. I don't know if anyone cares about Miss Tatcha anymore. No shade. But I mean, I don't think anyone's talking about it online anymore. I think it's kind of overrated. And people have kind of moved on from the hype but let me see if it is even worth the hype I've never seen reviews I just hear people always going like oh my god touch is the best so I would love to see you so day one let's get started but I'll do another before for day one. Why do I see improvement? <laughs> am I crazy or am I like seeing improvement? I don't know. Day one, I'm like, I kind of like it. Oh, you worth the hype, you just might be. I just use it right now and like when it dried, it wasn't like tight or anything. So that's a good feeling. It doesn't feel stripping. Day one and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Oh hey, it's day two. And yes, I'm wearing the same thing. Give me a break, I've been home all day and I've been doing a whole bunch of school work. Happy day two. This is how my face looks like today. And then I'm going to wash my face and I'm gonna come back and talk to y'all. Right, all my lotions and potions are on. This is how it looks. One thing I will say that I just, I couldn't wait to mention to you guys. When I woke up in the morning, my skin felt like supple. I woke up in the morning and my, like it just felt like Plump. Like when I tell you I woke up in the morning, my face, it was like this. It was just like glowing and like moisturized and supple. I don't know how to explain it. I should show you guys in the morning if it's like this tomorrow. I don't know what I mentioned yesterday, but the smell of the, of the cleanser is like very um, fresh. Every time I use it, I love the smell. This smells so good. And like it has little like kind of small little like grinds or beads in them, like very, very small. And like they're not in every single brush, like an exfoliator. It's in like every like couple brushes. I don't know how to explain it, but it's not like an exfoliator, but it's very, very gentle. It's day two, so I'm giving a lot of explanations, but I should let y'all know that in the beginning, of course. But yeah, that's my face. I'll see you guys on day three. Day three. And let's wash our face and I'll come back to talk to y'all. All right, day three, that's what it looks like. There's not much to say today. I didn't wake up this with the same effects like I did yesterday when my face felt like replenished. Like it just felt hydrated yesterday and I'm not having that same feeling today. I have been like breaking out a little bit like right here and stuff and like here. I don't think it's the Tatcha products but I will keep you guys updated on that. But yeah, day three, out. Hello and it's day four of me using Tatcha's cleanser. This is what we got right now. It's how my face looks today. Do you guys see any difference? I'm curious, but I'm going to wash my face. This is how we're looking right now. Ah. And I'm gonna go eat some food because I'm hungry. I shouldn't be eating past 1 a.m., but guess who doesn't care? See you guys tomorrow. Hello, we are here on day I lost track, okay? Four, I don't know, five. 
I don't know. <laughs> I have some makeup on today, so I'm actually going to be cleaning my skin and everything. And of course, I'm going to be washing with the Tatcha, so we'll see how good I feel with my face after I get with my makeup. I don't have a lot of makeup on, obviously. I'll be back once my face is clear and glistening and glowing and plump, okay? Oh, hey, we got a problem. You guys are probably like, Wondering how I'm changed while my hair is in a bonnet. Well, my hair is out. I just took out my braids because I'm gonna wash my hair. But the problem with this, yesterday I forgot to show you guys my face after washing, but I washed my face. This is how it looks like today. Do you guys see a difference? Honestly, if I'm being, I don't know what day it is, day whatever, but if I'm being real, real right now, my face looks gorgeous. Like it just, it looks stunning. Like day five, so we'll see. I do have a um, pimple coming in. It's a painful one and I don't get those. So it's like sometimes when my period comes because I get a lot of hormonal acne, but this one's painful and I don't remember the last time I had like really painful acne. Usually I get like whiteheads and then I have this one up here that's just also painful. So I'm curious if that is the wash doing this or if my face was just gonna break out anyway. I am like ovulating today according to my schedule and stuff. So that could be a reason also. But anyway, this is my face before. We're gonna wash your face and then we're gonna get back to us because that was my bad that I forgot. Okay, sorry, but I don't know if I ever showed you guys what it looks like, but it looks like this. It honestly like kind of looks gross. It looks like mucus, <laughs> but it smells really good. And this is what it looks like. So it's like a, like a, a jelly type um, translucent color. You see all the little bits and pieces? Um, this is what I'm talking about. It has little like bits and pieces on there and I'm guessing it's like the fruit extract. This I think does like maybe some mild exfoliation. So I let my face air dry because I wanna know what the product is like. Literally, if you can like, my face looks photo finished. Like I don't see any pores. It's insane. Like it feels like there's like a blur effect on my skin. Am I liking this? I let my face air dry because I want to know what the product is like and not my face is not dry It's not tight. It could be the product. That, that's a good thing or it could also be just because my skin is healthy Hey, I look crazy. I'm aware because I just washed my hair ignore it I woke up got another pimple right here kind of coming in, but it's not too crazy This one doesn't hurt as much anymore But I'm curious again if it's the cleanser or if it's just my skin. This is how my face looks right now It's definitely dry from the shower but, so I just want to show you guys before I see you guys tomorrow that this is what we're looking at. See you guys tomorrow. Hey guys, um, we're here. I think we've almost hit a week. This is how my face is looking right now. I'm going to wash my face and I'll be back to show you guys my face. I almost forgot to show you guys my face and I already put like some pimple cream on, but this is what we're working with. But I'll see you guys tomorrow, I guess. <laughs> Dang, this video feels long. This is what my face looks like. It's what we're working with. So let me wash it and I'll get back to y'all as usual. Here we are. Do you guys see any differences? I feel, I see a difference in the way my face feels. It feels beautiful. The only thing I have on my face is this tiny little white head. Focus right here. It's the only thing I have. Oh my God, my face looks beautiful. See you tomorrow. Um, this is the condition of my face right now. I have a little bit of acne coming in, hormonal, because Ms. Mother Nature is about to give me a gift in about a week. Let me go wash my face, BRB. This is how our face is looking. Are you guys starting to see a difference yet? Another day, another night, another wash. I feel very overwhelmed with work. It's a lot. Anyway, let's go wash. All right, we're blazed up. If you guys saw this before, I got this acne right here and this one, and they're just hormonal acne since I have a purr coming. See you guys tomorrow. Fresh face, makeup's off. Now we're about to wash the face. Clear. Except for my hormonal bits. <laughs> See you guys. This is how the face is looking right now. Before I checked in, sorry, I already put my little acne cream on because this thing is painful. But, that's what we're working with. I'm going to bed, this headache. Um, let me wash my face and I'll be back. This is what we're looking like right now, but again, and I'll be back. I couldn't wait, okay? So the pimple cream is on. You're gonna have to deal with it, but this is what we're working with today. 
Smile. I've been picking at my face, which is so bad. I was getting so much better at not doing that. <sighs> I guess stress, okay? <laughs> That's my life. So now I'm just going to be washing my face and I'll check back with you guys when my face is washed. Guys, I couldn't even wait. Usually I wait and keep my face bare to show you guys like any progress, but we're having a bad skincare day, guys. I couldn't wait. My face looks horrid right now, um, but this is what we got so far. We're gonna wash the face. This is what we're looking like right now. This is this disgusting pimple. I'm not feeling very well. I'm feeling cold. It's like freezing in my house, but I'm craving ice cream. So the dilemma. You guys can just tell in my eyes that I'm tired. I need to organize my classes tomorrow. Okay, let me wash my face. We are slowly coming to an end because the bottle is almost done. The face today. Remember, we're still going through our gift came today, Miss Mother Nature. Also, this is why I don't pop pimples, you see? It is not like this, <laughs> or like this, or like this. This is why you shouldn't pop pimples. Not this is why I don't, because clearly I just showed you three spots. It's slowly fading and the whitehead has went away. Yes, and there's no discolored spot because I haven't poked around and manipulated it. So the face, we got some acne going on here. We got some acne going on here. And that's about it. The rest is just acne that needs to heal. It's the face right now. Let's do the rest of the face. This is the face right now. Have you guys seen any differences? Got this acne right here. I think it'll be gone by tomorrow. You see this one basically gone. Yeah, I'll be back when I'm washed. I definitely almost forgot to kind of give you guys a rundown of the skin, but the whitehead, it's gone. When you don't touch it, it eventually goes away when you wash the face. Yeah, it's gone. I put acne cream on, and then yeah, I'm just a greasy mess. Anyway, I'm going to bed. See y'all tomorrow. And this is what the face is looking like. No makeup and all. I don't know how I've been feeling. I've been picking my damn face, so maybe that is why. I've been good at not picking my face, but since I've started using this soap, I've been really bad at it. Let's wash the face and then we'll be back as per usual. Here we are, glazed and all. I just touched my face. Okay, see y'all tomorrow. I just took off my makeup pretty much. So this is what we're looking like right now and I'm about to wash. And as per usual, I'll be back when I'm done. Little did I know, it's empty. So today was our last day using Miss Tatcha. So tomorrow, let's discuss the verdict. Hey y'all, it is Angie Rush here and we finally made it to the end of this video, finally. And girl, we're tired, okay? Yeah, we had to close that. <laughs> I just wanted to do a full little outro on my final thoughts of this product and I would love to talk about it with you guys. In the beginning of the stages, in the video, I talked about how my face looked and felt airbrushed, my pores looked noticeably smaller, and I woke up one morning with my face feeling so supple Within those 20 days, I only had that experience once. My pores actually do look more minimalized, which is cool, but that's really it with this product. As the days went by, as you could see, I don't know if it was stress or what, as you could see, the acne was starting to roll in. Minor acne, not anything crazy. There is a side-by-side, -side. I haven't seen it yet, but you guys let me know what you think of the side-by-side. -side. And if you think that my face looks different from day one to day 20, is this product worth the hype? No, I don't think it's worth the hype. I don't think it's worth banging $60 or $90 out of your pocket to purchase this. I just don't think it's worth it. I think there's so many other and way better options out there for you. I don't think this is worth it. I used it for 20 days and there was nothing that was that amazing and phenomenal out of this product that I haven't got from other products or from my regular cleansers that I like to use. Although this product was cool to try, it was not worth it and I wouldn't ever purchase it again. There's no negatives to it. I don't think it's a bad thing. I don't think it contributed to causing the acne on my skin or anything like that. I think that was just a hormonal issue because my period was on the way and I think maybe that was just a stress issue. I don't think this caused acne. I think this is a nice gentle cleanser. If you want a gentle cleanser and if you have the money to splurge, I just think it's on the very average mediocre level. I don't think it's anything too amazing and I don't think it's the worst product in the world. But let me know if you've tried this and what you think of it. Is it your favorite? 
favorite product. I hear the water cream moisturizer is like bombs, but we just tried the cleanser for today. If you guys have any other skincare products that you want me to try, let me know and I'll try them out for you. But this is a nay for me, and if you guys like these type of series or any type of products on my channel where I go throughout the month of trying them, let me know. I can totally do more. Sorry, Tatcha. I love y'all. Y'all are probably a great brand, and y'all have very good ingredients for the skin. Nothing harsh, nothing crazy. Again, it wasn't stripping on my skin. It was good, but it wasn't anything too crazy and nothing that I feel like I need on my face and I need to purchase again. My other products and my drugstore products work just as well. But thank you guys so much for watching this video again. I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys got a send. If you guys are interested in this product, let me know if you guys tried it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to comment and subscribe. I love you guys so, 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 so much. Remember to be humble, okay? And always remember, self-love is the best love. And it's not goodbye. Let's see you later. Bye, guys. Bye. Still getting closer to my dreams. Look, excuse me as I take a step closer to my dreams.